hi guys welcome to my channel hope you're doing well so sagittarius this will be for you if you have sagittarius as your sun moon venus rising north node or if you're dealing with sagittarius okay guys please remember that the roles can be reversed and these are general readings so take what resonates and leave the rest okay guys okay you know what no these cards so let's see what's going on for you guys let's see what's going on for sagittarius Oh, and I am doing um, personal readings. If you'd like to check the description box below, all the information that you need is there. I'm doing an um, offer for mini readings until the end of March, okay? So check that out if you'd like a personal reading with me. Okay, Sagittarius. All right, let's get into it. Straight away. So we have the Strength card. We have the Three of Cups. We have the Knight of Wands and the Two of Wands. Mm. Mm. Options, options, options. Someone's not being picked. Someone's being played around. There's, okay, let me put it like this, Sagittarius, okay? If you feel like someone's messing you around, yeah? Put yourself first, yeah? It's not even like, should I, like, put yourself first, okay? There's a new path there waiting for you, Okay? If anything, Sagittarius, this Knight of Wands, whoever this is, I would see this as a blessing. I know some, like when we go through things, like when people are disrespecting us, hurting us, cheating on us, it may feel like, oh, what, what have I done? Just know that there's something different, there out, like there's something completely different waiting for you, okay? This person's actually pushing you closer to where you need to be, yeah? And I feel like this is definitely a spiritual thing, okay? There's lessons to be learnt here, okay? I.e. putting yourself first, set, um, keeping keeping to your boundaries, okay? Things like that. So, it's not so much about who you're dealing with, it's about where you're going, yeah? Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords. Yeah, you're being called to, you, you're being called to take this new path, okay? You feel it. Five of Pentacles, what's this? Five of Pentacles and the Two of Pentacles. So some of you guys are like, should I go, should I not? Some of you guys might be, um, I feel like if you're in a situation where you're dealing with somebody and you live with them, you're thinking, shit, like I might end up homeless or I might end up having to start from scratch or, you know, I'm losing money, I'm losing whatever. But I keep getting this juggling energy. There's not just two people here, there's more than two people. Page of Pentacles. There's going to be someone to, to help you, Sagittarius, okay? Someone's going to offer you help, okay? In whatever way that you need it. Two of swords. A lot of twos here, like, what? Two, two, two. A lot of twos here. A lot of indecision, juggling, calling to take a new path, yeah? Some of you guys might be in your head too. So, yeah, two of swords and the four of wands. Someone's worried. Someone's thinking: Should I stay at home? Should I, should we get married? Should we stay married? Page of Pentacles and the Five of Swords. If you have children, they have been affected by this. Like, I'm sorry to have to, but like that's the first thing that I got. Like, you know, they they're watching arguments at home, or if this is you and you haven't got children with this person, like you don't really knowing this person's like this you don't want to bring children into the world knowing that this person behaves this way okay so this is a big this is a big heads up for somebody okay this is a big big heads up for someone you know like really think about it and i've said this love isn't enough okay we need respect we need consistency we need loyalty we need understanding we need good communication yeah love is not enough knight of cups six of pentacles i'm getting a few people are trying to help you you know so uh, this could be literally like by having conversation offering you somewhere to stay or um just literally discussing what's going on in your life okay someone's off, off asking you if you need help with money or they will be okay maybe you should look into that maybe take out a loan to help yourself 
I'm not sure if some of you guys are going through a divorce or something, but things seem to be quite up and down right now. Yeah, some of you guys are taking a break from this person. Some of you guys might have left left where they um left your home or your like um where you'd normally stay or or if it's not that then you're taking a break from this situation. I feel like somebody's avoiding making a choice here, I'm not gonna lie. Justice, yeah. Some of you guys could be quite a lot's come out. So there's quite a bit of pentacles here. All the signs are here. Leo, um Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, like all the signs are here. Like all the signs are here. Libra. Tell me more about Sagittarius. Page of Cups. A lot of messages. I'm getting like messages of concern. People are worried about you. Someone's not making a decision. Someone's not picking themselves. They're, they're worried about leaving somebody behind who's not actually helping them grow. Hmm. Okay. Please tell me more. Thank you. We have the King of Cups, Ace of Wands. Somebody might try and keep this connection going by... Um, someone loves the sex here, okay? King of Cups and the Ace of Wands. Someone loves the sex here. I feel like there's a lot of lust. I feel like this, like, this is not true love. I'll be honest with you. This is not, like, this is not healthy. Um, this is not good for you or for your person, for both of you. It's not good for you. I feel like there's a lot of issues going on that need to be addressed. Um, if you feel like this is reading, definitely check your other placements too. Something's not being, like, something's being swept under the rug here. Someone's, like, just choosing to stay. Um, okay. Five of Wands, some kind of competition, jealousy, and right on top of the Five of Pentacles, a lot of chaos here. Page of Swords. Someone's child has ADHD. Someone's child has um, ADHD or autism or communication problems. Ten of Cups, Four of Pentacles. Someone's trying to hold the family together to, to keep... This is not the 1950s, 1960s where it was a shame to be divorced or anything like that or break up. It's not those times. Mental health, like our mental health is much more important, okay? Times have changed. The laws have changed. Times have moved on. This is a very old, like, this is, this feels like something that would have happened in the 1950s or 60s. Like someone staying to keep the family together, but it's toxic as hell. Like, someone can see that you're not happy, the other person's not happy, whoever's in the relationship, and if you have children, they feel it too. So, whatever somebody's trying to do isn't working. I'll be honest, okay? This is just not working. And you may feel like you're doing um, the right thing is not, okay? Trust me, if you ask your children, they'll be much happier if, if uh, even if you don't have children, you know, you have to put yourself first to happiness because it really is like a domino effect, okay? I'm going to leave it there, guys. Please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.